Hmm, how do I describe the VTuber community? There's many words I could use to describe it. Hello, I'm Yu. I'm a pre Debbie Yandar No Sweet Chiba. Nice to meet y'all. Hi, my name is Cass Rosalia. My name is Mora. Hello! Hello everyone, my name is Mickey. I'm a Lunar Fox VTuber. Hi, I am Risa. Uh, hello! Uh, I'm the Red Peddler. Hello, uh, my name is Hiroi Saiken. I am a, in real life, an internal medicine physician. I'm Kaito Ayaga. I became a VTuber because for as long as I could remember, I've always used an anime avatar to represent myself online. And so becoming a VTuber just became the next natural step. And I was actually in a call with a friend who was streaming at the time. And we would play the game together and it was like so much fun. And that just made me want to do more of that, but without my face being seen, you know? That's where content creation came in. I, I absolutely fucking love it. Ever since I was a little younger, I had always wanted to be a content creator on YouTube. And then when VTubers became a thing, I had no confidence in how I look. Still don't. When you're a face streamer, you have to like make yourself presentable and pretty all the time. Right? You can't exactly show your like what your morning face. It really gave me, I guess, a voice. Better suited to be a VTuber. I was like, oh, what's that? Ah, ha, that's weird. But then I like slowly got into the community. I've been wanting to be one for a long time. Uh, one of the residents that I worked with like found my Twitch off of my Instagram. You know, like as an incoming physician being like, do you really want like your patients to see like this product that you're putting out just like you playing video games? I watched a lot of uh, Gura. It was, uh, of course, Kizuna Ai years ago. Kizuna AI? 2016, actually, with Kizuna Ai. The beginning of 2022. I found VTubing around back in 2020 because of a podcast named Trash Taste that I watched. I, mean, I think it was 2020. 2020. In October of 2020. So right when Whenever, yeah, Hololive first, uh, Myth, Myth debuted. debuted. My first model was actually, I drew something myself. Like, it was a very, very rough sketch. I don't know how to draw, I just needed a face. Commissioned 2D model in the works. And my personal preference would be my 2D model. I like the styles of 2D, me doing a little more. I just like to have the options. I enjoy the 2D style more. I mean, for me, I found this model on Nijima. It's a doctor and I'm a doctor, so. A 3D model because my friend uses 3D animation and said he would make me thumbnails. It's 3D, so I thought of 3D because I majored in 3D animation prior. So I was thinking I could use my model and animate with her. Man, I absolutely love 2D titties, so I'm 2D all the way. I post on YouTube. How about YouTube? Well, I think YouTube is the easiest. YouTube and Twitch. Uh, Twitch. Personally, I'd rather be actively online. I have a schedule. I stream three times a week. Twitch right now. But at some point, I'm going to try and break that cycle. And I, I definitely do want to work more on YouTube. But if I'm being entirely honest, I just, I'm not too fond of my own voice. Twitch, but I do want to expand my content, especially onto YouTube, Reels, you, you know, Twitter. TikTok, all that fun stuff. Usually when I'm on breaks, I'd be streaming daily for no reason. Streaming for like, I don't know, 15 hours max. I have no life, quite frankly. Realis and Mariyume and Zekos and VTuber Senpai. Anna Elouette. I look up to her now. Just because she's gone through so many hardships and I truly think she deserves her high position that she's in now. She represents so many communities that otherwise wouldn't have a voice. Quite frankly, I, I don't watch people. Oh, when I look up to somebody, I gotta know them. My friend Ninja Anime, he was the first other uh, PNG tuber that I had met. Well, isn't that obvious? It is my Oshi, the one, the only, the woman of sex. <laughs> Millie Parfait. There are two other doctor VTubers that I like look up to. Shiori Pon is a surgeon in the Philippines. Uh, Dr. Athiana is a pulmonary critical care in Australia. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I don't know. If anything, I feel like it's it made it worse. <laughs>
I think with how the situation was with the world for the past, you know, few years. VTubing has helped me a lot to come out of my bubble. It has been very therapeutic. To improve my social skills. Connecting with others because I'm so introverted. Like back then, I only really talked to my best friend. It really kept me busy and it really kept me looking forward to something. Because I keep making more and more projects for myself, on top of VTubing, I feel like I am burning myself out <laughs> while also maintaining a full-time job. Of course, every community has its bad side. I regret doing that giveaway, if I'm gonna be honest. As much as it, like, it got me up to affiliate, the numbers aren't very you know, matching. This is so easy, having no viewer. <laughs> I was setting everything up for 30 minutes on stream and I barely didn't know what to say. Essentially threw a tantrum on stream and rage quit. We, I've had like random interactions with random people that have like come begging for me for like, you know, legitimate like health advice. Trauma dumps. And I'm just like, this is a medical emergency, dial 911 or your local emergency services. I'm not going to give you a consultation over Discord. Interacting with someone uh, who was also interested in the same video game I was playing. Uh, my uh, my audience that has been staying with me this long time before I became a VTuber stayed with me. I think overall it's just been fun. I wouldn't be as far as I am today without the amount of support that I've gotten. And somebody actually donated 700 bucks in like one of my first streams. And then another stream, they donated like 700 bucks again. So while I was talking, my my steam was just popping up and they're like hey you received a gift you received a gift from this you received a gift from that and i'm like whoa wait a minute wait a minute hmm how do i describe the vtuber community there's many words i could use to describe it in shambles <laughs> expansive together confusing cool the vtubing community can be so uplifting and supportive and i've never met anybody who was a bad person like i mean obviously i saw i saw you know i hope people be more sensitive that there are things that might be happening behind behind the scenes i wish we would all be a little bit more nicer to ourselves and to everyone else they do need their moment they need their rest yeah v tweeters and lewd tubers that just kind of like jump on trends and try to be risque for the sake of being risque how genuine and sincere people are High time, you know, honesty needs to be a thing. Parasocial fans. The wholesome parts are very wholesome, but the toxic parts are very toxic. I think VTubing has been limited extremely by video games and the idea that you have to start or you have to play video games to be able to get content. We have to stop assuming that you need the highest value equipment. There are free ones out there. Making people into OCs. Make my streams more interactive, mess with me in-game. I get uh, Smash Elite players into my Discord so that I could one day do a Smash Elite tournament. And I have tournaments in many different kinds of fighting games. I want a live concert. I would like to have those like VR headsets and everything so I can like move it with my hands and legs. Learn choreographies. VR concert and then I could be like a DJ or like a K-pop idol and be like, whoa, whoa. Definitely more concerty stuff. Of course, with friends, of course. Yeah, yeah. I, I definitely can't sing alone. <laughs> Me walking around outside in real life around Japan. I would really want to work on my lore, world building, where she's from, who she is. It's something that I don't even plan for. Like, it's not even in my wheelhouse to, like, try to dream this big. I would say being being detached from VTubing while being a VTuber is totally fine. Thank you so, so much. Thank you so much for having me, and I hope that was somewhat insightful. Have a good day. Sub, sub, go and sub. No. Help Lickers get her thousand subs. This is supposed <laughs> to be for you. <laughs>